Okay, team. Last session of the week. So we're on a we're on a pulley day uh, today. So good one for us to finish off the week with. Lots of nice shoulder and back work here. So we're going to start with three rounds of our five cat cows, just because these are the best, I think, anyway, to get in getting warm up for some nice pulling. So from there, shoulders sink. Uh, shoulders come together. Scaps come together. Let that chest sink, and then press up into that cat position. We're really spreading those scaps. That's one rep, so we're gonna do five of them. Then hit into our 10 swimmer hovers again, just because these are great exercises to get ourselves warmed up and our back nice and warm. So from there, we're on our front, hands come behind our head, they come out as if we're gonna breaststroke, thumbs point down, we come round to our back, almost touch our bum, and then back and back to our head, okay? So that's our swimmer hold. Then we're gonna finish off the warm up with eight tabletop transitions. I want to get these in in the warm up today because we've got a lot more uh, pulling work to do. So, tabletop transitions, we know it now. Sit into that, that tabletop, move our weight through, hips come up, nice stretch down the bicep, and come back round. Okay? So, eight for each side. That's our warm up for three rounds. After that, then, we are going into a single arm bent over row, 15 reps per set with a three second lower. So, just some nice um, single arm work, okay? Three sets on each side. Again, I want to get everything done on one side before we move on, okay? So, three sets, 15 reps, three seconds lower. Hinge, chest comes over, row in, make sure it's coming low so that we've got the lat turned on, not up here, so the trap's coming on low. One, two, three. One, two, three. So, 15 reps on each side. So, 15 with a three second lower. 60 seconds rest maximum, back in, same side. 15 reps, three seconds lower. So we hit the three sets on one side and the three sets on the other side, okay? So just make sure we're really, really, you can minimize that rest as much as possible. So we're really working on fatigue, fatiguing the muscles, that's fantastic, okay? So bent over rows first. We're then going into a single arm dumbbell or kettlebell snatch high pull, okay? So I want some relatively big reps on this so we go 15 to 18 reps and we're going to go three sets on each side so six sets in total I'm happy for this one to alternate so 15 to 18 on the left 15 to 18 on the right and back to the left again okay so our snatch hip uh, kettlebell or high pull so our snatch kettlebell dumbbell high pull okay so from the front my hips are going to go back shoulders are going to come forward soften the knees so I'm in that bottom kind of dumbbell kettlebell snatch position from there then hips are going to open up and I'm pulling up so it's that finish is here okay shoulder back and out okay I'm trying to get that shoulder back and out there I don't want it <coughs> up here okay in okay so from there hips open okay 15 to 18 on one side switch it over 15 to 18 on the other Really think of a nice open pull, okay? Really extend, open that armpit up, get that hip that and get that drive from the hips as well, okay? So 15 to 18 reps each side, three sets each side um, of the high pull on that snatcher with either a dumbbell or a kettlebell, okay? So that's our th second piece. Our third piece then, we're just gonna go for 15, because we did 50 last week, I'm gonna change the movement slightly just to get the numbers up. 50 weighted sit-ups, they can be unweighted if you want them to, so it's just 50 sit-ups, whatever weight you've got. So, I'm just gonna pop my weight up here into this top position, like that, and I'm gonna roll back, and then I'm sitting up. Okay, for 50 reps, however you wanna get through it, however you wanna break it up. But that is session four, that's the week. Please give us a shout if you've got any questions. Um, and yeah, hope everybody's well. Doosh.